What's going on, everyone? It's Marcellus back with another video. We got to go over Shiba Inu here today. As you can see, Shiba Inu is doing some good numbers today. You know, it's up a little bit today. Everything's trying to recover inside the crypto market. But yeah, we're going to be going over this today. So anyways, hit the like button, subscribe. Really helps the YouTube channel out immensely for the YouTube algorithm. Leave a comment in the comment section and let me know exactly what you all want me to go over next. And also, if you want these automated trading indicators, definitely check out the Vital Algo link in the description and use the discount code Marcellus for 25% off. Remember, I'm not a financial advisor, none of this is financial advice. So let's get straight to it. As you can see, the 24-hour market control for Shiba Inu is actually in control by the bears by 60%. Same thing kind of with Dogecoin and everything else. As you can see, Dogecoin has actually some really big gains for the day because, you know, Elon Musk talking about accepting Doge for payments for Tesla. But I think Shiba Inu is about to have another huge jump as well. Remember, we're about to get a whole game. We're going to have a whole game for Shiba Inu. It's going to be a metaverse type game. So that's going to be coming soon for Shiba Inu. We're going to have payment we have payments in everything with bitpay you can store stuff in bitpay you can buy with shiba inu in bitpay you can do all that in bitpay and then we're just, we're just we just got so much stuff going on for shiba inu you know it's not it's not old news either i mean it's not new news either we already knew all this stuff is coming out so you also got to think about the burns shiba inu is also going to be implementing burns so we got a lot of stuff that's going to be coming out with shiba inu we're working with william volk to help produce this game also play size studios so we got lots of things going on here with shiba inu and we're getting new listings as well so let's talk about some shiba inu stuff so anyways let's back out of this let's talk about some technicals and what we got going on here so you can see right here all of these green areas are supply and demand showing more demand there's so much demand for shiba inu all the way from 3330 all the way down here to about 3000 pretty much 30000 so that is very good. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0003 and then all the way up to 0, 0, 0, 0, 0033. So that is a lot of demand there for Shiba Inu. Now the red area shows less demand, but there's only like a few red areas. Now up here we have major, major resistance for Shiba Inu and less demand, as you can see around the uh 3800 area or the 3750 area. But still, we're still doing fairly good. So let's talk about technicals. Shiba Inu bulls await right timing for top line breakout. That's actually pretty bullish news for Shiba Inu. Look at this. Shiba Inu price is trading sideways between the 29.25 and the 37.85 area. They're actually pretty right about that. If you look at this and you scroll all the way down, you can see down here around the 29 area, that's where we have the bottom of that support for that supply demand area. And then at the top way up here, you can see the um, other areas of supply demand showing more demand for Shiba Inu. And everything actually just now went off my screen. Let me go control Z this all the way back to where we were. All right, there they are. There are the indicators. All right. So all the way up here, we have the resistance. So there's a lot of good stuff going on for Shiba Inu inside the technicals. So let's go over this. Now, Shiba RSI is almost flat, showing a balanced equilibrium between buyers and sellers. That probably also means for the overall crypto market too, Bitcoin and everything else, because everything's following Bitcoin and all our charts look the same. So if that's the technical for Shiba, it could be the technical for Bitcoin too. As you can see, look at Bitcoin's seven-day chart and then look at Shiba's seven-day chart. They look very, very similar. All of them, even with Ethereum, Binance Coin, all that, they all look similar, except Dogecoin. Dogecoin is the unicorn right now. But yeah, anyways, let's keep going with this technical analysis. So the next thing that you want to go or that we want to go over to here, expect the volatility to pick up once a catalyst lights a bullish breakout. So like I just said, we have major catalysts coming out for Shiba Inu, and that is what's going to ignite the breakout. And that's what's going to make Shiba Inu go crazy. So anyways, Shiba Inu price is trading stuck between a 16% variation bandwidth as price looks for direction with neither buyers nor sellers putting forward any big moves so as equity markets shift towards towards gains expect this to spill over into cryptocurrency and act as a catalyst for a bullish breakout pretty much so taking price above a top line that is capping price action for the moment following such a breakout expect bulls to push shiba inu 61 percent 0.8 fibonacci level all the way up to the 4490 area which is 00004490 that is a huge jump so that's pretty much 35%, or actually more than a little bit more. So Shiba Inu price of which equities tailwind. So sparking this could spark a 35% rally. So Shiba Inu price has been trading sideways since the last week as investors find themselves puzzled as to the path forward. So much event risk lies on the horizon with a lot of great decisions from the most prominent central banks this week and some pending uncertainties over COVID variants. So on Monday, European equities already stated or started the week 
in the green pretty much and the early trading hours the u.s indices i don't know that how they said that they meant embassies are also quoting in the green so this sentiment could be the catalyst current cryptocurrency investors are waiting for to uh to spark a late christmas rally pretty much so over here you can see sheep price could see bulls attempting to surmount the red descending top line from december 1st pretty much so this price would pretty much it would pretty much lead the price up so leading to several rejections to the downside a breakthrough would be the cue for the sideline investors to join the rally if this is the case and as buyers volume sees a significant uptick expect the subsequent rally to hit the 61.8 percent fibonacci retracement level at 00004490 quickly so that is definitely the area we're trying to reach here with sheep here's pretty much the charts that they're talking about so we got all the way down here at the three zero area as our support and then we got up here at the 4465s as our major resistance. We got the little bit of consolidation that we're going on right here. And we're about to end the pretty much reach the end of the consolidation. So that pretty much is going to lead us to have an increase. So once around that level, it will become increasingly more difficult for investors to drive sheep price higher as liquidity starts to die down year in pretty much. And they're saying around the 4490 area is going to be hard for sheep to do that. If most central banks keep their loose monetary policy going, expect a boost of confidence that would spark another leg higher towards the 50% Fibonacci retracement level at 5690. So if central banks come out more hawkish, on the other hand, expect a quick deflation of the price as investors cash it in on their positions, triggering a sell-off towards the monthly S2 support level at 00001260, holding a 60% potential loss. So that's pretty much the very bearish scenario. But if we look at the bullish scenario here, the bullish scenario could actually have us outweighing the risk for the bearish one. So there's definitely potential here. And you can look over here at Yahoo Finance. They're pretty much doing the same type of technical analysis here. The first major support being 00, 00, 00, 000, 000 And then the first major resistance being at 00, 000, 000 360. Right now we're at 3396. So we're pretty much right in between the support and resistance so we're we're still doing pretty good as you can see over here you can even see the resist resistance in the support levels like coinciding with each other so we definitely have a lot of good stuff for shiba inu that could come in the future with the technical rules and with the fundamentals which is going to be pretty much what helps us rise because that's how we're going to end up breaking out of all of these consolidation periods all these downtrends like when we get big stuff like this like bitpay like that helped us out a lot when we get the game that comes out that's going to help us out a lot like we got a lot of good stuff inside shiba inu that are going to help us cracking like we got we got major catalysts left and left like cracking adding us like that that's huge like we that like that was big so we have so much big stuff coming out for shiba inu like Every single time we have these major catalysts with Shiba Inu, we always do good numbers. The only reason why the Kraken thing wasn't really too big for Shiba Inu was primarily because we were already going in a little bit of a downtrend in the crypto market. So Kraken less than Shiba Inu wasn't really the, the thing that could make us take off. But what could make us take off is Robinhood listing us right now. So that could definitely be a huge major catalyst for us. Anyways, we have 1,060,805 holders. Yesterday, we had about 1,053,000. Yeah, or 56,000. 1,056,309 holders. So we're almost at 1.1 million holders in Shiba Inu. We might even be, at, be there by the end of the year. So definitely expect that. That should come by the end of the year. But uh, anyways, that's all I got for you all today. I just wanted to go over all that good stuff with Shiba Inu and let you all know what we got going on with the technicals and fundamentals. But yeah. Hit the like button, subscribe. It really does help the YouTube channel out immensely for the YouTube algorithm. Leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you all want me to go over next. And also, if you want these automated trading indicators, definitely check out the Vital Algo link in the description and use the discount code MySellers for 25% off. If you want to help support the channel, definitely go ahead and send a donation through the Cash App or PayPal donation link in the description. And remember, I'm not a financial advisor. None of this is financial advice. And I'll be back with another video. Peace.